From the last video on mensuration where we spoke about what mensuration is all about, if we move the discussion to the 2D objects in particular, there are two major things that we look to calculate. Area and the perimeter or circumference. Area of 2D objects such as circle has pi r square. For shapes such as square and rectangle, it is the square of the sides. Thus, for a square, it is a square and for the rectangle, it is length multiplied by breadth. Likewise, if we talk about triangles, we can actually have half multiplied by base multiplied by height. Now, if it is a right angle triangle, the area becomes half multiplied by base multiplied by perpendicular. And for the rest, it is the shortest distance between the base and the top apex. On the similar lines, when we talk about the perimeter, it is the path that is required to be traversed by someone to cover the entire shape. For example, in the case of a circle, a person starts from one point and takes the entire circle to reach back at the same point. Thus, circumference of a circle comes out to be 2 pi r. For square and rectangle, also it is the sum of all the sides, coming out as 4 multiplied by a for square and 2 multiplied by length plus breadth for rectangles. For triangles, it is base plus hypotenuse plus perpendicular. With these concepts, all the questions that we come across from 2D are now easy to solve. 